Hey everyone, Shadow here, and welcome to another Marvel Contest of Champions video. So the Dr. Voodoo and Shang-Chi Arena is over. Round two is done. I did not go for either of the champions. However, the last time I got a five-star Dr. Voodoo. Then I saw the featured crystals, the featured pool, and in there is... A Scarlet Witch. I do not have a five star Scarlet Witch. So I want to get five star shards. And so I was not happy to see Dr. Voodoo instead of the uh, 5,000 five star shards. So for the first time, I'm actually going for the 5,000 five star shards. Usually I don't really care one way or another because they're not champions that I want in the uh, five star crystals. But she's in there. So this time, I went lower than I normally go. I only put up, well, I put up about 28 million. And I'm hoping that that was enough to get me the 1% to 5% and not get me Dr. Voodoo. Okay, I'm usually good in the uh, basic with the 1% to 5% at 12 million. But uh, last time I put in like 30 million and got Dr. Voodoo. So I'm hoping that's not going to be... Uh, the case this time. All right. You can see I've already gotten all the milestones in the uh, basic for this next arena, but let's find out. All right. We got one to five percent in both of them. Beautiful. That is what I wanted to see. And of course, I did all of the uh, milestones in the summoner trials. All right. So Shang Chi is the basic. So let's take a look at that one first. And I put in, like I said earlier, 12 million. So let's see if we recognize anyone. Uh, folks were going hard for Shong Chi. And I don't blame him. He is an awesome champion. Definitely one of the better ones that they put out this year. Um, Dynamics, congratulations, ranked 17. Moneyhead, congratulations, ranked 20. Um, but I did not go for him. I would love to get him, but I'm saving my energy for uh, Hercules. That's when I plan to go in. Now, I think he only went for him round two, I believe. We'll find out. We'll see if we see his name in here. Um, yeah, I'll be looking for it. I can't remember if he went round one and got him or not. Uh, but I'll let you know. Uh, if I see his name. Uh, right now, I don't see anyone else I recognize. No, no, no. Getting down there, getting down there. Hope I did not miss, because I do that. Okay. There he is. Okay. Woo! 90... Three, Brian, 93, you uh, by the skin of your teeth. Congratulations on that Shang-Chi. I believe he did it uh, without using any units. And he was grinding hard. I don't know what he ended up with score-wise, but uh, he was getting up there. He was getting up there. So congratulations, that is who I was looking for. I was pretty sure he was going for him. Usually he goes round one. So that's what was confusing. I'm usually the one that goes for round two. But this time he went round two. He probably couldn't go round one. Uh, but glad to see that, man. Glad to see that. Uh, and you guys can look at his videos. You'll see what score he put up. I'm going to go check as well uh, a little bit later on. Because uh, I also have a crystal opening that I want to do uh, after I make this video. Uh, but anyway, you are the final one. Is that Pound Edward? You're the uh, last person to get a six-star Shang-Chi from that basic arena. All right, let's see who is Mr. or Mrs. 101. Oh, you stuns. You are probably very stunned. Sorry to see that, man. All right. I don't know you, but you have my condolences. 
All right, let's see all of these guys here. You have my condolences. Uh, I, I would love to get them, but I don't want to burn myself out. And I feel like this one would burn myself out. Not only that, but I would want to focus only on this arena. And that would mean that I would lose out on all of the units in the other arenas. Because you'll notice I go for the units in all the arenas and I get all the units in all the arenas. But if I were to go for Shang-Chi, that wouldn't have happened. Sammy, APG. Congratulations on that, Shang-Chi. And so that's why I'm saving it. We also have Cyber Weekend coming up, and I want to save my units. Yusuf, that name sounds familiar, but I don't know if you are the one that I remember. But congratulations anyway, just in case. Um, but yeah, so you can see I'm at 17.5K. You know, I was at over 20k i was closing in on 25 and i would have had like 30k by now but kabam successfully milked me of my units uh with those offers uh that they had in the store i i couldn't pass those up and i'm glad i didn't i i expanded my roster crazy good no regrets but i wanted to make sure that i had enough and and i do um Along with my uh, uh, battle chips, I'm good. I'll be able to get all the um, offers and have something for uh, the gifting event afterwards. And hopefully, I'll have units when Hercules comes around uh, in January, and I'll be able to pick him up there. But I plan to go hard for him. All right. Now, let's look at Dr. Voodoo, who I would have loved to have gotten as a six star. I would have. I love Dr. Voodoo. Um, but as you can see, I stopped at 28 million, hoping that I did not put too much. I, I went and looked at the last cutoff and everything, and I thought I had uh, put in too much. So I was happy to see that I got the one to five percent. Uh, the Bearded Gamer. Mm, congratulations, Jensen M. Congratulations, big boys. These guys put up big boy scores. Ribbon the Rock, congratulations. And even though me personally, I feel like um, he needs to be awakened, I would not play him without being awakened. A lot of these guys with the big boy rosters, they've got ways to awaken them. ID Slim, congratulations. So... More power to him. Wanja, congratulations. Black Gamer, congratulations. Ooh, lots of people going for that voodoo. San Miol, congratulations. I haven't seen you in a while, man. I hope you're doing well. Consigliere, congratulations. Uh, man, that was a lot of people that I recognized. Dr. Voodoo, man. Rob Von Schu, congratulations, man. Mm. Okay, we're getting down to the end here. And... Honshi, you are the final one to get the six-star Dr. Voodoo. Enjoy that Dr. Voodoo, because he is awesome. All right. Who is Mr. or Mrs. 101? Oh, and that is painful. I can't even imagine what score you put up. I know he went low, though. Um, He didn't go crazy, crazy high like, like some of the most wanted champions. So maybe the score wasn't too crazy. Maybe you just were putting up as much as you could just to see what you could get. Um, But, yeah. Never like to see that because you'd be like, oh, just a little bit more, maybe a couple of rounds and you would have got it. All right. So let's see what else we got here. Hercules, Hercules. Weapon triple X. Okay. Whippersnapper. Young whippersnappers. Uh, let's see who else. Yeah, a lot of the folks that I knew that were going hard. Bite! 
Congratulations. BYK. You may not have gotten a, a Dr. Voodoo. And the five star is much easier to awaken. Lakers bodyguard, congratulations on that Dr. Voodoo. Uh, I know that I didn't play Dr. Voodoo as a five star till I could awaken him. I stuck with the four star. Um, but that was me. Just, I do not like fighting doc with Dr. Voodoo unawakened. So even if I had gotten the six star, I wouldn't play him unawakened except in the arena. But that is going to do it, guys. So now that I've gotten that, I should be able to open up five featured crystals. Uh, five star, five, five star featured crystals. Uh, and I'm going to make that video right after I get this one uploaded and published. And you'll see that one tomorrow. All right. So take care. Hit the like button if you enjoyed the video. Leave a comment. Let me know what you thought about this video. And you all have a blessed day.